guys let's talk let's talk let's talk you know uh i have a lot of people on my dm that are saying that they want to get nationality from brazil and also a lot of people who are also saying that they want to get nationality from uh southern america or central america or caribbean countries guys let me tell you one thing second passport is best you know we shouldn't always depend on our passport our passport i always say that our passport doesn't go anywhere we the africans our passport doesn't go anywhere our passport is weak our passport is, is is crazy it doesn't go anywhere so we we have to think about getting a second passport because all the southern america here all the caribbean countries when you have their passport when you have their passport it can go to all the europe countries for free it can go to it can go to all the southern american countries for example when you have Brazil passport, you can go to Panama. You can all the uh, you can go to Nicaragua, Honduras, uh, Guatemala. You can go to Panama, uh, Bahamas. You can go to Grenada. You can go to the Dominican. All these countries can go there free of charge without any passport. Even if you're having uh, uh, citizenship, uh, not citizenship card. If you're having uh, residence card you can even go to all these countries for free so i urge each and everyone to get one you know I, some a lot of people think that but it's very expensive yeah you know it's because our mind is telling us that we can't afford it we can't afford it that's why we always our mind is also saying that we can't do it but there's nothing that we cannot do it i always tell people that you know something there's nothing that you cannot do it. There's nothing that you cannot do it. Everything that you thought of, everything that you think of, it means you'll be able to do it. You know, even nowadays, Americans are looking for second passport. Americans are you, a lot of Americans are in my email looking for second passport. They want me to help them to get a second, uh, for them to get a second passport. So a lot of people are saying that how they can go to uh, Dominica and what they're supposed to do. Uh, a lot of them are buying prop, uh, properties. A lot of them are buying properties, houses. A lot of them are investing just for them to get that documentation. Just for them to get uh, citizenship. Do you understand? That's why a lot of Americans are coming to Africa. You know why? Just for the second, uh, the second passport. It doesn't matter. Just get your second passport. If you are in Africa, I will urge you to get your second passport in Caribbean, in Southern America, or Central America. Because our passport. If you want to get your second passport in other African country, man, you it's like you are moving from from pan to fire. Do you understand? So, if you able to get a second passport from any of the Central America, Caribbean countries, Central America uh, is best. You know, so I will urge each and everyone just to get one. The second passport is the best. That's where most of African uh, Americans are moving in to Africa just for them to get a second passport. They will come. Yeah, I'm an African. I'm I'm that. I'm that. Just for them to get an African passport. Just for them to be dual citizenship. You know, I'm going to give you some of the countries that it's easy for you to get their documentation. Easy here in Central American, Caribbean countries, and also Central America. So, if you're here with me, don't worry. Please subscribe for more videos. Subscribe and share with your friends please just help me to get 20,000 subscribers please I know that a lot of people who watch me don't subscribe it shows on my uh, on my on my details 
on my YouTube that a lot of people who watch me don't subscribe. I'm just begging you, okay? I'm just begging you. I've seen a lot of people have been benefit of just watching my video and they are able to get to their final destination. A lot of people are now in uh, in Bahamas. Bahamas was giving a visa free to Ghanaians just recently. I think last last month or last two months. And if I tell you the number of people, number of people that have gone there, you'll be shocked. You know, I'm doing everything possible to help as much as I can, as many as I could, Ghanaians, Africans. You know, I'm proud to be an African, and I will always be proud to help an African uh, fellow Africans. I don't care whether I'm from Ghana, but I know that Ghana is in Africa, and Africa, one day, Africa is going to reunite. One day, we are also going to have Africa united. And that is my biggest dream that Africa should be united. If you have African passport, if you have Ghana passport, if you have a Nigerian passport, you can rule the whole of Africa without a visa. And this is my biggest dream that this should come to power. South Africa have already started, Kenya has also started, and I know that very soon other countries are also going to do that. Please, guys. I'm doing my best to help others. So please also, please do your best to also help me. It's free, you don't pay for anything. The subscription is free. Just subscribe, even if you don't watch it again. Just subscribe for me. I'm just begging you. That is all, okay? Thank you so much. And guys, let's go. I'm gonna give you the easiest country that you can get second passport from and these are the same country that i'm giving i always tell um, uh, those that i do consultation for them uh, in the united states yeah guys if also if you want to do a uh, one-on-one -on -one conversation you can let me know it's just uh, talking then we can work on that okay so let's go the first one is dominican dominican is one of the uh cheapest and easiest country that you can get a second passport Within two to three months, you can get your, uh, your second passport. Two to three months, you will get your second passport. So guys, if you are interested, click on that. Go ahead, Google it, search in, and you will get it. It's easy, as simple as that. You don't, it's, it's, you don't need to go to that country. You don't need to go there. The only thing is just go online, buy a property, the money is no you are no uh, uh, you know they are going to charge you a little bit it's not free but they are going to charge you a little bit you know when i say a little bit you know when you go online they will charge you like hundred hundred thousand uh, dollars uh 150 dollars 120 dollars 125 dollars uh 125 thousand dollars yeah and this Within two to three months, you will get your second passport. Two to three months, you will get your second passport. Guys, if you have that money, don't waste your time. Don't waste your time to go to any embassy. Just apply for that and you will get it. And the money, you are not going to give that money to them for them to chop it or for them to spend it. You, for example, if you want to do that, they will tell you to buy a property or invest in the country. It's like you're going to open a company in there and invest that amount in that company. Employ people, work with them, that is all. As you are getting money, you're also getting your passport. Or you can buy a house. Do you understand? You can buy a house that worth of $120,000 or $100,000. And within two to three months, boom, you get your passport. The passport will be emailed to you in your home country. If you are from Ghana, they will send it to you in Ghana. If you are from Nigeria, they will send it to you in Nigeria. That is all. So guys, it's simple as that. 
as simple as ABC. Okay, let's go. The next country is Venuetu. Venuetu, you know, this is a country a lot of people will be thinking that it, what is this a country? Yeah, it is a country. Venuetu is one of the beautiful country that you need to visit. Yeah, and there are also two to three months you can also get your passport with the same amount or they will increase it a little bit. That is all. And we have Antigua. A lot of people are also going to say that it's Antigua a country. Maybe some of you guys, it's your first time to hear of this country. Some of them, you know, some of you guys also know about it. You know, those who normally go online and search for, do researches about the country like me, this, are, this is not a news to me or to us. But those who are new to you, you also you know learning something. Yeah, so that is uh, Antigua. Antigua is a, a country that when you able to get your passport, it can go to Europe, the whole of Europe, Asia, Japan, Korea, China, or Dubai, all these countries for free. It can go to UK, Germany, Holland, name it, all the Schengen countries, it can go there for free. Then the next one is Babuda. Babuda is another country as well. If it is the first time to hear this, you are learning. Today, I'm taking you a little bit deeper. Yeah, about geography. I didn't learn geography, but because of traveling, I've learned a lot about countries. Yeah, so there are also two to three months you can get your documentation, your passport, boom, then that off you go. So it also go to all these countries for free. And we have St. Kitts. St. Kitts, that is S T. K I T R T T S that Saint Case. Yeah, that is it. Not Kiss. No. Saint Case. Yeah, that is uh K I T T S. That is Saint. You put the Saint, then you put a case over there. And that is all. And set it. Or sometimes they write it Saint Case and Nevis. Yeah, because it's a two different countries that they have joined their sub together. So it's Saint Case and Nevis. And with this country, the same thing, two to three months you get your passport if you invest some amount of money in the country or buying a property in the country or donating this money to some AJ, uh, NGO or any uh, like government official uh, uh, project they will give you the passport for free of charge yeah it's not free but you know you are not from there you are not born over there so if they are giving it to you it means you bought it so that is it. And we have St. Lucia. St. Lucia is also another country that they do the same thing as well. We call it uh, nationalization purchase or uh, investment of nationalization of uh, investment. Nationalization of investment. Yeah. So you can also invest in that. And you can get up, uh, the same thing. It's two to three months as uh, others. Then we have the Grenada. Grenada is also doing well. They are giving. Grenada is just around here. It's, 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 it's not long. It's just around here. Yeah, so. These are my top one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. These are my top seven central and Caribbean country that is easy for you to get their passport by uh, investment. If you invest some money, then you get that property. A lot, a whole lot of Americans are buying uh, houses over there just for them to use it for Airbnb, and they are getting money from the Airbnb and at the same time getting their passport. Within two months, you get a passport. So guys, if you know someone who can borrow your money just for you to do that and you know you can do Airbnb you buy a house with that amount and you do Airbnb with it then you pay the person a little bit you know if the person is going to accept it man off you go thank you so much guys the more videos are coming these are the tips on easiest way easiest and simplest way to get second passport adios I'll see you guys in the other video don't forget to subscribe and share Support me and let me support you as well.
Thank you so much. And I'll see you in the other video.